now being included. Now we're gonna take it out of the adjustment. So I'm gonna say, all right, let's go back on over here. Schedule one, page number two. And we're gonna say we had to pay that jury duty to our employer because they paid us the normal salary, which would be better because normally, of course, jury duty doesn't pay you that much. So I'd rather, if my employer will pay me, then I would rather take the employer's uh, normal salary money or hourly money oftentimes. So I'm gonna put the thousand here and the jury duty uh, given to employer box. So now that's gonna be adding up down in line 26, pulling back on over to the page 40. So now we've increased our income by 1000 and then we pulled it back out by the thousand, bringing us back to where we started at the adjusted gross income. I can mirror that over here on our worksheet with the uh, adjustments to income. This is gonna be then the jury duty. So let's just add like another line. I'll insert a line, jury duty, jury duty. <gasps> jury duty. The uh, employer paid reim reimbursed or paid jury duty, let's say, paid to employer and that's going to be let's just put it out on the outside 1000 and boom let's make that bordered let's make this blue and that'll pull in because it's summing up to the first page and so now it's been included here and then we took it back out in our formula back to the 100,000 on the adjusted gross income so there it is so that might not come up all the time, but if there's questions about jury duty, some of those are some of the kinds of questions that could come up. Do I have to include jury duty and income? It's usually a fairly insignificant amount unless they were there for a long time. Uh, but then the question will be, well, yeah, you typically do, but what if my employer, you know, uh, is paid me for jury duty and then I gave the jury duty to my employer? Well, then why would you do this? Because why don't you just not include it in there at all? Because we want to tell the IRS that if the IRS, for example, had had documentation of your jury duty, then we want to be able to match it just like with any, any kind of 1099 situation and say, hey, yeah, I got jury duty. There it is. I know it has to be included in income, so I'm doing it. And then I'm also telling you that it's not really something that I got to hold on to. It's not really income. So I had pulled it back out again so that there's no net impact on the adjusted gross income. So kind of showing the audit trail there.